Welcome to our video tutorial on using Raspberry Pi Pico W with Blink. In this tutorial, we will show you how to control the GPIO pins using Blink. By learning this, you can make your projects even better. Imagine being able to check and control your devices from far away and also get notifications about your projects. In this tutorial, we will use Thony Editor and Circuit Python to build the code for this project. If you are not familiar with Thony, check out the video in the description to learn how to get started with it. Visit the CircuitPython website and download the latest library bundle. Unzip the file and locate these two libraries. Copy and paste them into lib folder on your CircuitPy drive. Go to Blink website, create a new account and log in. Start by creating a new template for PicoW. From data stream, add a virtual pin. Then add a new device. Select the template that you have created. From web dashboard, add a switch. Now copy the token and let's start writing the code. Open the settings file and type in your Wi-Fi information and paste the Blink token. Then open code.py file and paste this code into it. Save the program and run it. Now you can control your PicoW through Blink platform. You can also use the application on your phone to do the same thing. All you have to do is to sign into your account, click on PicoW device, then from the widget box, add a button to control the GPIO pin. That's all for this tutorial. Go ahead and improve the code to make better IoT projects with Blink. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Stay tuned and see you next time.